It's time for our technology report and joining us now to tell us about something new in the kitchen is our tech reporter, Paul Ndiho. Hello Paul. Esther. Hey. Online cooking videos come in handy, but uh, 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 using mobile devices in a kitchen can get messy. A New York University student has solved that problem by turning the traditional apron into a remote control. Tina Trin has more. Oh, is a novice when it comes to cooking. So she does what many do to improve their culinary skills. Watch online videos. But things tend to get messy. It was annoying to touching my iPad frequently with my greasy hand. O came up with a hands-free solution she calls the recipe controller. It's a smart apron prototype that lets users navigate online videos without touching them. And you can use this apron like um, remote controller to control your video contents while cooking. The apron uses an Arduino microcontroller, a single-chip computer that has Bluetooth connectivity. Everything is connected, even the apron's print. This is, looks like uh, just normal print, but actually this is a uh, conductive fabric, so uh, I can program, I program it. The apron relies on soft circuitry, the use of alternative materials to create electrical circuits instead of traditional methods like wiring and soldering making them easier to integrate into fabrics and wearables. Sewing the print to the metal slab with the conductive thread, so it's connected each metal slab with um, each print. Each print is programmed with a different function, and tapping them will pause and play videos or rewind and forward them. Need to raise the volume? Simply slide this pole left or right. The rope that it hangs on is conductive. O considered incorporating spoken commands, but the technology turns out to be less helpful in the kitchen. Hey Alexa, Siri, pause the video is relatively long, but tapping is more simple. For O, the best creations are equal parts design and tech. The electronic module detaches so that the apron can be thrown in the wash. I want it, my apron looks like just normal apron. It's a recipe with delicious results. Tina Trin, VOA News, New York. That's uh, today's uh, technology reporter. Back to you, Esther. Thank you, Paul. Be sure to join Paul Diho each Wednesday for another tech report on Africa 54.